Hello and welcome back everybody. Today it's another day, some more wonderful, wonderful art. Okay, so today this is purely inspired by my brother's artwork. So I'll like explain you while showing you, I will explain to you while showing you this picture. So this is his artwork and he made it at school and me and my mum thought it was like loads of different footprints. Um, but he was like, no, no, it isn't. But I think that it's good that we thought that because now I am inspired by this and I'm going to do art like this using footprints. So I will be using my watercolours and I will be doing sections like that. And then I have made this really like detailed chart. So basically it's the animal, but human. So I've got animals like all my animals down there and then I've got the footprint of them and then the colour background that they're going to go on so those animals are a bit like different so I thought oh it'll be really cool to use them so let's go through what you, you guys need today I have got watercolour paper next you will need of course actual watercolours and then I have got a sharpie a fine point sharpie and then I've just got my fine line marker for the really thin bits like this maybe. Oh, I'm just trying to find another. That. So, yes to that. I'll be doing 14 different colours. Here they are. Ooh. I just swapped those ones because those ones were too dark. So I swapped that to that area and that green. Those are kind of the same colours, but hopefully it should be okay. Now I can start getting my different paints ready and now I can start. I'm just going to put this on, get some more water on. It's going off the edges a bit. I kind of want it to go off the edges because that will just make it blend in more. Okay, now I'm going to do this one and I think I'm going to do this one. Color. Color, color. Okay, so it says that we get a bit more, a bit more wet. That's more wet. So you get some just plain water. I'm gonna make it go in with the green. That is okay. I'm not too worried about that. Not too worried about going over the edges. You guys could use completely different colours to me or completely different footprints. All that matters is you do the art with me. And don't don't think, oh mine doesn't look good, it looks amazing. Just everybody has a different style or way of doing things. Okay, so that's faded into that. It looks really cool. Hopefully you guys can see the effect as well. Give my goose colour to get this going. Goose, goose, goose. Goose, goose, goose. I want this colour to be quite vibrant, so I'm not going to use too much water. Give me this last as you can see it's faded in with that as well the effect has started people getting loads of paint on them now okay now this one finished okay you guys now this is the part where it's got to dry so yeah i'll see you guys when it's dry bye 
Okay guys, so I've done, it's dried and I've done some of it just so you guys weren't wait, waiting around and you had time to do the artwork yourself. So now I'm going to do the rest of them. So let's go. Okay, I think I'm going to do the elephant one on here. Okay, elephant's done. Now, elephant sparrow? Yeah. Okay, let's do dog. I'm gonna do pencil with dog first because dog is quite hard. Okay, now I can do the sharpie on this. Sorry, I just turned it sideways on you guys. Okay, now for this one. This is the hair, so this is quite intricate, so I'm also going to do this in pencil. Okay. Sharpie for this. I wonder what you guys have been doing. I hope you've been doing some of my videos, the drawing and the arts and crafts. Okay, now this one, frog. Now this. This guys requires the fine line pen. Oh, wrong way. Okay, I'll just do it this way. This is the squirrel if you guys didn't know. Okay. Now just this, and then we'll be done. This is the deer. Okay, let's go. Great. Oh, guys, it's finished. Look at it. It's so amazing. With all the different paw prints. I'll do an extreme close-up so you guys can see all the detail. So we've got so many different animals on there and my brother's picture and using that and that has inspired me and I hope this has inspired you to make your own piece of artwork and yeah, thank you for watching this video, please like and subscribe and bye, see you later guys.